Hey guys, how's it going? So, uh, it's been a while since the last time I made one of these, probably like a, that's gotta have been at least like a month and a half since I recorded one, but, um, yeah, I thought we'd go to the Tech Nines now. Now, it's been a while since I made one of these, so, I don't know, I can't remember, I think I just downloaded the pictures of Cisco Stash, but it never did this before, but for some reason, if you can see some of the sizes of the guns, like the pictures are different. Even though I checked, they're all the same sizes. Like if you see here, this is clearly bigger than this. These are like the same. This is looks a bit bigger than that, but some of them are smaller than the other ones. I don't know why I tried to fix it with putting it in the um, different fucking modes or whatever that it would like portrait and landscape them all that. But this one was the one that looked the best. So I thought, whatever, fuck it. It's not that big of a deal. Um, but, um, yeah, I'll probably go through this pretty quick because, um, I don't know, I don't have a lot to say about the Tech 9 as far as skins go, and, um, I don't know, I've really been playing CS so much recently, so I probably won't, um, talk about all the skins as much as I have in the last videos, but who knows, this video will probably end up being an hour long like they always are, but, starting off, so I got the fucking CSGO stash on my phone, obviously, too, because... I've, a lot of these I don't know. They're, they're like just some of them look so similar that I just have to look up fucking the names or whatever. But starting with the red quartz, uh, this one ain't too bad. We're gonna have to pop that mid though. That's a it's a very average uh, looking skin right there. Not too fucking shabby, not too bad. But um, yeah. Then we got the god. This is a light blue, I believe. I oh, know. Yeah, yeah. I believe this is the. Is it a Glock? Is it the high beam? I think it's the high beam. Looks like the fuck. Is there a Tech 9 high beam though? It looks exactly like the Glock high beam. Which I know because I've gotten from the. I've gotten the high beam from a drop a couple times. Is it not called the fucking high beam? Oh my god. Oh, maybe it's the titanium bit. Maybe it's that one. Looks very similar to the high beam. Yeah, I think it's that titanium bit with it. Yeah, it's got to be the titanium bit. I thought it was the high beam. It kind of looked like the high beam. Uh, this shit's not bad, too. I'd probably put that in mid also, right behind it, though. Um, Yeah, it's in the weapon case 3, so that's an old-ass skin, actually. Damn. Didn't look that old. Looks like a newer skin, but... Um... Yeah, then we got the, uh, fuck, I don't know how that skin either. As we can see here, the Ossified from the Aztec collection. Oh, that's a newer one. I think that's Ossified, right? Yeah, Ossified, yeah. Um, kind of like that, actually. I like the green on it. I'm gonna have to put that, um, I'm actually going to put that in shit. Let me look at it again. I want to put the picture ossified. I like the really clean skins, like with it's just basically on the barrel or whatever, and then there's like nothing on it else. I kind of like that on the tech nine. It looks pretty good, but um, I'm also probably gonna put that in mid, but the top of mid we'll put it for now. Might move it after. Never fucking know. Uh, then the next one we got is... Shit, I forget what this is called. I feel like I've gotten this before from a... From a case. The re... Shit, the re-entry from the... Chroma 3 case, which... Yes, the re-entry. Um, this is not bad. This is not bad. i probably put that right about there. A lot of mid skin so far, but... You know, I feel like a Tech Nine is gonna have a lot of them, a lot of just like pretty bland skins because they're not gonna look bad because they're all like pretty simplistic, which you know I like in skins all the time, but they're never gonna be like fantastic because they don't ever ever go out there for anything. Then we got the uh, Tech Nine Ice Cap from the Gamma case. I was just thinking this as like a fucking Ice Cap from Tim Hortons. Um. I'd probably put this right about there. God, it looks so annoying. Like, 
it's so noticeable from to me like the size difference it, it that shit kind of pisses me off but i was way too late i'm way too fucking lazy to try to change the sizes on these because there's 30 fucking six of them i just wanted to get one of these out there and i thought tech nine would be a good one because there's like not a lot of there's like no nice skins for it so uh also another skin that doesn't have a single covert i think it's got like three pinks but they're all kind of dog uh wait let me see one, two, three. Yeah, three. And they were all pretty dog. Ah, eh, two of them are all right. Um, but yeah, then we got the, uh, oh my god. This looks exactly like fucking that. Bro, is that the same skin? What the fuck? I don't think it is, but like, what the shit? I might have mixed that up with the other one before. I have to look through all these fucking bitches, because those look identical. Um, okay, I think this is the blue titanium. Dude. Oh, I didn't even say blue titanium before. It was the other, wait. No, 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 no. Wait. What's the other skin I said? Oh, the titanium bit and the blue titanium. So fucking similar. I think this is the titanium bit, so I think that was right. And this is the blue titanium, I believe. Let's see here. Yeah. I think so, yeah. Oh. Uh, this one's pretty just basic. It's kind of just got, like, some blue on it. I'd probably have to put that in C. Um... Yeah, I got really nothing going on with it, but, uh, yeah. Then we got the, uh, I think this is the brass, is this the brass? Yeah, Tech 9 brass. Um, I'm gonna, actually, I'm gonna move that up to mid, um, because I think the brass is a C tier, but I think it's definitely worse than that. Uh, brass is just an ugly color. Fuck it. It's pretty expensive suit in fact new one thirty five. Not too shabby. Um but yeah, brass is just something I don't fucks with. I don't fucks with at all. I do not fucks with. Then we got the Tech Nine. Is this the cutout? I believe this is the cutout. I don't really know what's going on with the designs there. It kinda reminds me of like the fucking uh what's it called? Darkwing or whatever, Aug. Kind of got the same shit going on there. Um, I'm gonna have to put this in C right above that though. Ah, uh, I'm gonna nah. I'm gonna put that in. I'm gonna put that in mid also. But I'm gonna put it at the back of mid. It's okay. It's alright. A lot of these skins are just super super bland, but that's the thing. They're not doing anything where I think it deserves a below average. I I, I like like I said. I I do like basic skins all the time. I'm glad they haven't ever added animated animated skins, like full animated, like they did in fucking Valorant and CS. That'd be horrible. But then we got the Tech Nine Isaac, which is kinda like the red line, but I really do not like on the Tech Nine. Um I'll be honest. Hmm. No, I actually that's not I'm gonna put it at the back of fucking I'm gonna put it right above that though. I like red and black together, it's just I don't really like the designs on it, but I don't think I like the colors enough for it to be still in mid. I'm kind of filling up the fucking shit in mid. Like holy fuck. Uh, then we got the Tech Nine. Uh, what is this? This is the. It starts with an S or an M. Probably gonna be way off, but I think this is a purple. Right? I think I've gotten this in a case before. Oh, uh, it was an avalanche. Okay, I'm retarded. Um. Uh, shit okay shit okay um it's got like a fucking a on it, it looks like the avengers skins. um hello hello holy shit my head i have like the playback thing so i can hear myself talk in my headset and it just like completely cut out and it sounded like i went fucking deaf IRL. um hmm i think this is going for a little bit too much i'm gonna put that in c i'm not really liking that too much I like, I don't know, the colors are okay. I like the the bit of blue in it, but the black I don't really like. 
that light blue and black don't really mesh well, I don't think. But, um, yeah. Then we got the Tech 9 Bamboozled. Tech 9 Bamboozled. Um, the Prisma case. Got a little CSGO logo thing on it, which looks kind of cool, but, um, I'm not really rocking with this, I gotta be honest. I gotta pop that top of C. I I'm not really a fan of the green there. I don't know, and the brown on the bottom, I don't know. I don't really like it too much. Not a fan, not a fan. Um, then we got, what skin is this? This is the... Shit, I've seen this skin quite a few times. It's like the M-Bar or something? No. The cracked opal, not even fucking close. Um... <sighs> because you go, I swear, I like only yawn when I do these videos. I don't know why. It's so randy, but um, I actually like this. I'm gonna have to put this in A tier. This is dope. I like the blue, the little cracks and the blue light in it. Kind of reminds me of like I don't know. I don't know what it reminds me of, but it's fucking really cool. The only thing is, I wish the brown on it was like a different color. I, I maybe it'd be in like go to tier if it was like the blue cracks or the blue, almost like neon lights shining through it or whatever the fuck um like vats of acid or some shit uh I, th I think it'd be better if it was like maybe black or something i don't know i do like this though um i don't yeah i don't really like the brown on the back but the the blue crack shit makes up for it crackhead shit and then this is jesus christ this is gonna be hard to find because i don't know what skin that is either holy fuck I have to hold my phone up next to that because it's fucking. These videos just make me look like I know nothing about skins. It's so funny. I I've seen the obviously the massive massive majority of these skins, but honestly, f for skins like the Tech Nine, I don't really look at shit like that. Um, because for a lot of the skins, I have like r like my a, a good skin for like the. My favorite out of all the ones I've seen. I just forget about the rest most of the time. Um, it's not that. I think it's this one. I think it's the flash out from the CSGO 20Ks. Um, rough. That is a rough looking skin. I'm going to have to put this right about there. Um, damn, it's just uh, void of anything, really. Um, bland colors, bland paint job going on. Looking like dog. Uh, then we got the this is the this is the sandstorm, right? I think this is the sandstorm. I think this is a purple. Uh, it's from I want to say it's one of the cases that came out around 2015. Is it a blue? Yeah, I think it's a blue actually. Yeah, the sandstorm Operation Phoenix weapon case. What that came out 2014, I think. Yeah. Um. Not not a fan of the beige and then the fucking purple. Um, I'm gonna have to put this right about there. Um, yeah, not not too good of a skin, but um, but yeah. Uh, then we got the what is this? I just saw this earlier. I forgot what the fuck this thing is called. Uh, the sne the sneak nine. Um. Damn, that's just cheap. In the Horizon case, colors on the top are terrible. The only thing is that there's like a little snake and a conda going through it, which is kind of cool. But it's still a very uh, ugly skin, I can't lie. If this was like, if it didn't have the snake on it, I'd probably put it in L skin. But the snake's kind of cool, so I'm going to put it right about there. Just because of the snake. Um, But, uh, yeah. Then we got the Tech 9 Decimator. This has got to be the Decimator. Decimator, yes. A hundred and seven dollars. Oh, it's from the shattered web case. Hundred and seven bucks for Staty Factory new though. I've never been a fan of these. I kinda like the pink and that blue kind of eighties theme going on, but I really just do not like the designs on them on the A1S or the Tech Tech Nine or uh I think it's just those two that have the decimator. Yeah. Um But Ah oh, But um yeah, I'd still probably put it mid. It is a pink, though, so it is pretty rough for a pink, but I'd probably put it right about... i probably put it right about there. Um, yeah. 
should have been a lot better than it actually is. Then we got, is this the control panel? Another pink? I believe that is the control panel. Um, 70 bucks, 70 bucks. I actually like this more than the A1S. This is not bad. Um, but yeah, I'd probably have to put this in I have to put that in A tier above the uh, fucking opal, whatever it's called. Um, usually circuit board type ass shit doesn't work for me, but when the color, I like the blue on the top, and I think it just fits pretty well together. Um, yeah, I think it's deep. I think it's pretty good. I think it's a pretty good skin. Tech nine is very shit for skins though. So if this was any other gun, I'd probably put it in like fucking mid or something. Um, but yeah, then we got the Tech nine. Is this the brother? No. Wait, is it? The fuck is a Tech Nine brother? Oh, it is. Oh, uh, I was trying to look for the face. Oh, uh, it's got a little terrorist fucking character model on the back of it. The back of the gun, like right, right back here, but you can't see in the picture, which is really cool. But it is by far the coolest thing of the skin. Other than that, the skin is super ugly. I can't lie. Um, and for that, I'm going to have to put it, I'm going to put it at the top of C tier, but the face on it is really cool, but Jesus Christ, just the paint job is just like ass. Like, it looks like a fucking bulldozer that was thrown in the wash and like just fucking smeared. Oh, my headset did it again. And just fucking smeared. I'm going to try to hurry this shit up because usually when my headset does this, it, it does it more and more often and gets wonky. But yeah, then we got the... Tech nine. We got the Tech Nine. Um Holy shit. The nuclear threat, Jesus Christ. I literally own this skin. I can't I can't believe I couldn't remember what it was called. Um Do I have a minimal wear one? They're eighty dollars. Fuck. Factory new six hundred bucks. I think I have a, f a low float field tested, but I might have a min wear, I can't actually remember. I think I have a low float field test, like a point seventeen or something. Um yeah, that's gonna go in goaded. Uh, I think this is by far the best Tech Nine skin, probably. I always like the Nuclear Threat Collection with the uh, that the P two fifty, and then um, those are the only two I believe, right? But there's like um, there's like the Radiation Hazards, which are very similar to it. No, no, there's another Nuclear Threat, isn't there? Fuck man, is it? No, I think it's just the two. But I, I'm let me look this up. I believe it's just the two, but for some reason I'm not. Nuclear threat. Okay, no, it's just the Tech Nine and the P two fifty. Yeah, um, there is skins like the Radiation Hazard and stuff from the Cash Collection that are very similar to the Nuclear Threats. But um, I always like I've always I've said this before in the other videos I've done with skins like this. I always like the little nuke symbol and the green and the black just looks really nice on this skin. Especially how the, the the little radiation nuke symbol is super bright. Um, this is kind of a... I mean, if the little nuke symbol wasn't in this, this would definitely be like in mid. But it definitely makes this skin. And it's a rare Tech 9 and expensive. So that gets the buff, baby. Yeah, the nuclear threat is a nice skin. But um, yeah, then we got the uh, Tech 9. Who the fuck knows? Who the fuck cares? Um, fuck, this is a blue. I want to say, ah, uh, oh, I want to say from a case that came out in the last four years, maybe? Operation Wildfire case, that was 2017, so five years. Um, ugly colors, ugly design. Now we're chopping that up right about, fuck, man, we're putting that right about there. That's pretty ugly, I can't lie. Um, unfortunately. <laughs> But yeah, then we got the Tech 9 fuel injector, which I used to have one of these because I used to have the AK fuel injector and the Tech 9, but um, sold both those obviously a while, quite a while ago. Probably, fuck, it's probably been five years. Um, but yeah, this isn't too bad. Um, I put this in. I probably put that in A right, right behind the control panel. I think the AK fuel injector is a lot nicer than the Tech 9. I don't know where I put the fuel injector in my tier list, but I honestly think I probably put it in A tier, but like back of A tier, I'd probably move it to fucking goat tier. 
when I had the skin, I always like liked it. But every time I pick it up, I'm like, fuck, the fuel injector is actually really nice. The yellow on it, like, I think it's a top 5 AK skin in the game after the, the Hydroponic, the Wild Lotus. Um, I don't know how I ranked them in the list, but the Hydroponic, Wild Lotus, the, um, um, Night, Night fucking, Nightwish, uh, Jet Set, and then probably the fuel injector. Um, but... Uh, yeah, I, I think the fuel injector looks really nice in the AK. It still looks decent on the Tech 9, but obviously not as not as good. And my headset did, did it again. I don't know if you... I think you'll still be able to hear me when it cuts out, but I don't know why the fuck it's doing that, man. Um, I gotta unplug it, but I feel like if I unplug it, it might stop my fucking... Might fuck up my shit. Um, but then we got the Tech 9... Christ, which one is this? Holy shit, some of these skins look so fucking similar. Okay, I believe this is the Hades. Th these three skins have like the same finish, just slightly different fucking colors. Okay, let me break it down, let me break it down. Uh, I think it's that. Okay, this is the Hades. Yeah. Oh, I think it's a blast from the past in the ancient collection. I've actually never seen this. Oh no, I probably have. I probably have it. Just it's such a forgettable skin that I forgot. I think this is the blast in the past. Yeah, yeah, this is the blast in the past. Um, I like the little rock formation tile shit going on there. Um, the color is really ugly. So, and it's obviously like a pretty low grade skin. So. Um, I'm gonna have to put this right about there. Um, yeah. Then we got the Tech Tech Nine Bamboo Forest. I'm gonna look this shit up. I have four Drug War veterans on this Tech Nine. I don't use it, but uh, funny enough, technically it is the oldest skin in my inventory from how long I've had it. Uh, I got this the day I bought CS. One of my somebody I played with. One of my friends uh, sent it to me with a bunch of other skins. I ended up selling all those, but I still have this. And this must have been, like, when did I buy the game? Like, August 2015. So, this skin is by f not by far the oldest, but, like, August 2015. And then I have, from November 2015, I probably got, like, five skins, maybe six, maybe even seven. I got my Lightning Strike still. My MAC-10 Neon Rider, which I don't use, but I still have. Um, my Glock Water Elemental, which I have, but I don't use. Three, um, and then I got a couple others, like a Negev and a couple other skins that I, I'd still have from them. But yeah, this is the oldest skin I have. I have f four Drug War Veterans on it. Uh, low Float, Fact New 2, point zero point zero four twenty. Now I don't have that float. I don't know what the float is, but, um, I always, I like this because... I mean, it's the same kind of thing as the uh, hydroponic. It's obviously nowhere as nice, but um, it's still I still really like this with the with the weed memes and shit. And it just looks really clean with the green, the white background, the green leaves on it. So honestly, for that, fuck man, I'm gonna have to put this. This is such a dick. Like this is so biased, but I'm gonna have to put that top A tier. Um, I just think it looks nice even without the skins. I've never actually really really like thought about it, but the color fucking palette and the color scheme on I really like the white and then the little hints of green. Looks really nice, but um, yeah, from the Rising Sun collection, I have a fuck, I have the AUG from that. I got the AK. What else do I got from this collection? Uh, the AUG, the AK, and then just the Tech Nine, I think. Oh, I think I have a bamboo print too, maybe the weed bison, the weed bison, the weed. The, oh my god. Um, but yeah underrated pick but um fucking pretty dece uh yeah then we got the just was looking at this what the fuck is this called by myself better than you i know it's wrong but what should i do the foobar the foobar i like how there's like a little bit of fade action going on at the end of the barrel but um another camo theme skin which is jesus christ there's a lot of them a lot of them in this fucking game for some reason, but 
I'm gonna have to put that right about there. Um, yeah, the camo isn't unbearable as some of them are, but um, jeez, pretty pretty rough. I can't lie. Then we got the Urban DD pad, which I'm gonna put probably right about there. Urban DD pads are, you know, not as not as bad as some people think, but I think they're. Uh, yeah, low grade skin. Then we got the uh, Tech Nine Terrace, which I really like this color, color fucking layout going on here. I'm actually gonna put this at the bottom, back of uh, A tier. Um, actually no, I'm gonna put this. I'm gonna put this above those two. Um, I like the mag, the yellow mag. Reminds me of the bulldozer. I wish there was a yellow fucking like a bulldozer Tech Nine. That'd be really sick. I love the bulldozer and whiteout themed skins. Just the one, just one color going across it. Um. And it doesn't, it, and it's like, it doesn't have that glossy look. It just kind of looks like it was just painted on there. Um, it looks really nice, but I don't really know what's going on with the, the design on the gun. It's like just yellow and black little random shapes and shit, but I like it. I think it looks good. Then we got the Tech 9 Hades. Um, this is the Hades, right? Yeah. Which is a cool skin, because if you um, scrape it, holy fuck. Yeah, it's from the Gods and Mons collection. A light blue, though, and this shit's worth 20 bucks for fact new. It's actually crazy. Best collection in the game. Rising Sun is a close second with the Hydroponic and the Akihabara Accept and the Bamboo Forest and skins like that. But the Gods and Monsters collection got the Medusa, Poseidon, Icarus Fell. I mean, the, the Cronus, the Cronus, the Autos. It's pretty cool, actually. Um, Minotaur's Labyrinth. That's okay. The, the Pandora's Box. Fucking goaded, man. Um... Yeah, Sun and Leo is, I mean, for, is okay, I guess. The Hades, um, Shipping Forecast, that kind of looks cool on the M249. The Moon and Li Libra, the Asterion, even the low-grade skins are fucking good for the low-grade skins. But when you scrape this, the, the Spartan helmets, or whatever the fuck they are, basically turn to skulls, which I think is really cool. Um, but it is a gray skin, like it is, well, it's a light blue, but it is like... The color is just all, everything's gray on it. So, but for the fact that you scrape it, and it goes like that. I'm actually gonna give that a boost. And I'm probably gonna put that right about there. Um, yeah. It honestly, like looking at it from a distance, it almost looks like an urban DD pad kind of. It's the same colors going on, but give it a little, give her a little boost because of that. Um, but then we got the um, this is the there's an AK skin of this, um, the something mesh. The uh, uh, fuck. Um, the, the safety net, not mesh. Um, yeah. Uh, this is um. Damn, I don't actually hate this. Um, this is not too bad actually. I'd probably put that right about. God, I think I like it better. Than that. I'd probably put it right about there. I don't actually mind that. I like the orange on it. It's not too bad. But then we got the fuck. God's name is this. The Orange Murano, I believe, from the Canals collection. A bunch of little fucking flowers and shit. I don't even know, man. I don't even know when she, you know? Um, Jesus. I don't mind that, but the brown background kind of makes everything blend together. I feel like it would pop a little bit better if it wasn't like that. But I'm going to put that right about, right about there. It's not too bad. Not too bad. Um, It's not terrible, but... Yeah, then we have the Tech Nine Toxic. I like this. The orange and the the light blue going together looks actually nice. I would probably put this. I probably put this up here. Probably put it right about right about there. I'm actually gonna move this and above it too. Um, I like that. I think it looks cool. The skulls, little skulls on it, and the little radiation things. Yeah. Um. I think those colors mesh well together, actually, surprisingly. But, um, yeah, then we got the Tech 9. Holy fuck, what is that? I think that's the Phoenix Chalk. Yeah, the Phoenix Chalk from the Havoc Collection. Um, geez. Looks like some graffiti and shit's going on there. I don't, I don't really know, bro. Um, probably put that right about there. 
Um, yeah. I said I'm gonna move that there. I'm gonna move that down to Alaskan. That shit's ugly as fuck, man. Like, straight up. Um, yeah. Then we got the Tech 9 Vari camo. Um, pfft, yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to pop that in L skin too. I think that's pretty pretty rough. Um, not too good looking, but um, yeah. Damn, I didn't realize these all these last skins were just perfectly lined up and all fucking dog shit. Um, jeez, what? Cause I'm on a plane. Um. I can't tell what the fuck that is. Um. Okay, I th I think that's the okay. I was thinking it's this is the army mesh. Um. Boys, we know where that's going. L and at the back L. Damn, we we t I I pretty much every time I make these videos now, like the last three, I've um when the skins get. Popped in at the bottom. I don't put them in in chronological order. They came out like I do with like all the zombie tier lists I've been doing. But I just kind of like to pop them in randomly because that would honestly take way too long trying to find all the dates for them. But um, I always move them around. Just drag, just one bop bop, like move them randomly. And somehow this one, the last like six seem to be like the worst six out of all. I don't know how, but and then we got the Tech Nine Groundwater. Um. I think this is just clearing owl skin territory because color is really ugly, but there's, they're they're doing nothing terrible with the design. I don't think it's just very basic, but yeah. Then we got the Tech Nine Tornado, which same kind of thing, but I'd probably put it right about right about there. Um, yeah. Then we got the last, but not least. Um, from a distance, this looks so garbage, but. It's got the rust leaf from the St. Mark collection. This actually isn't ter like I don't hate this skin. I like the little like um like the rusted leaves. It's kind of a unique design, but a lot of, I mean it looks like a lot of skins from the St. Mark collection, so but I don't actually hate this as much as I do looking at it from a distance, but I probably put this honestly right about there. Um it's not as bad from a distance, but yeah, it's pretty much it. Um like I said, not a lot of great skins in the Tech Nines arsenal. A lot of shit in mid and C. One skin in goaded. Um, pretty much, like I said too, for like this, I've for pretty much every tier list I've done, L skin territory. Anywhere from one, I gotta always at least put one in goaded and one in L. I gotta put at least. I mean, it. My rule isn't to put at least one in every tier, but like C mid and A tier are basically a lock for at least having you know, three at least. And that would be in, in A tier, you know. Pretty much most skins are locked to have at least, like, eight or nine in, in mid and C, but for Goaded and L, I gotta at least put one skin, because this is Goaded for how good the skin is compared to the rest of the skins, kind of. If this was... If I if this... If I combine this, the Tech 9, like, I did a tier list of, like, Tech 9 and AK skins combined, the Nuclear Threat would be in, like, the A tier. I wouldn't have a single skin in the GOAT tier, but I don't think this is a goaded skin as far as all the skins go, but it's goaded in a sense of the Tech 9 skins. It's still a nice skin, but... Like I said, the Tech 9's a really bad gun for skins. As we can see here, um, there's just nothing good. They need to add... I don't know. They need to add some more nice purple or pink collection skins, or they need to add a covert for for the case, for a case, because every fucking case either has an M4A1S, an M4A4, an Opper, an AK. Sometimes it's got two, it, uh, but it's always got one of those, and then it has like a pistol as the other one, or you know, occasionally they have like a Randy skin, like an MP7, which is they should do. Like they need, I think they need to add a covert skin for every gun. Like for fuck's sake, the R8 in its first case got a covert skin. The Tech Nine doesn't have a covert skin. Um, I was about to say the Five Seven, but the Five Seven has an angry mob. Um, the Tech Nine, I mean, the Negev, the Negev, the Mjolnir is a pink, right? Or is it? A, I think it's a red, actually. I think the Mjolnir is a red. So I think the Negev has a covert skin. Okay, the M two four nine, it definitely does not have a covert. M two four nine Tech Nine. Um. 
Both the auto snipers don't have one, I believe. Um, the MP5 SD, I don't believe, has one. And God, I think that's it. The MP9 didn't have one total. They came with the fucking Starlight Protector or whatever, which is pretty recent skin. Like, dude, they overfill the fuck out of AK AK skins, which makes sense. Like each case, I do believe should have either AK one of the M4s op. Or USP or Glock. Um, but they should always have one of those. But then the other skin should always be just a Randy skin. Like the Tech 9 or the fucking CZ or something. You know? Um, so, yeah. Valve out of fucking Covert Tech 9 into the game. But, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching, guys. And, um, yeah, the next one we'll do will probably be the 5.7 and then the CZ. But, uh, yeah.